What are the different methods of opening and closing a file in C++? File must be opened before reading and writing from the file. Either OF stream or F stream object may be used to open a file for writing and IF stream object is used to open a file for reading. To create a file, use either OF stream or F stream object and specify name of the file. To read from a file, file stream object can use extraction operator. To write into a file, file stream object can use insertion operator. There are two ways to open a file in C++ using constructor of stream class is used when a single file is used with a stream. Using open method is used to manage multiple files with the same stream. First method using constructor of stream class. Constructor of stream classes if stream, of stream, or f stream can be used to initialize file stream object with the file name. Example to create a file stream object of if stream that open a file named hello.txt using its constructor. If stream followed by in is the object. And first we have mentioned the name of the file hello.txt and next is the open mode ios in. In this case, in is the object. It creates an object of if stream named in and file hello.txt will be opened and attached to it for reading purpose. Similarly, OF stream and F stream object can be created using its constructor with a file being open and attached to it. Example, C++ program to open a file named data.txt and write student's name and age using OF stream object. After that, read details from the file using IF stream object file data.txt should be opened using constructor of stream class. So here in this case, we have only one file, which is data.txt. By using OF stream, first we write some detail into the file and by using IF stream, we read the data file, read the details from the file. Now, in order to open the file by using OF stream and IF stream, we have to use its constructor in this program, first we have to perform the write operations. In order to perform writing, we require OF stream object. So first we create OF stream object. Object name is out. By using the constructor, we are mentioning the details of the file and output mode. So the file will be open data.txt with the object out. By using this out object, we can write details into the file. So we write details into the file, name and age, we are writing into the file, and then we close the file. Now, in order to read the data from the file, we require IF stream object. Now, while we are writing the detail, we are using insertion operator. Insertion operator can be used to write the details into the file. Now, in order to perform a reading, we require IF stream object. So we create an IF stream object. And by using the constructor of IF stream, we mentioned the name of the file that needs to be opened. So IF stream, IN, IN is the object of IF stream. And the name of the file is mentioned inside the constructor data.txt. So that file will get open for input mode. Now, by using this IF stream object IN, we can perform read operations. In order to perform the read operations, now 
we declare two variables name and age and in order to read we can use the extraction operator so by using extraction operator from the input stream we read the details and store in name and age and we can close the input stream then after that we are displaying the details which are already read from the file in the variable name and age so in this example first by using of stream object we are writing the details into the file and after that by using an if stream object we are reading the details back from the file in both the case of objects of stream and if stream we are opening the file by using the method of constructor within the constructor of of stream and if stream we are mentioning the name of the file and the input output mode which is required for opening the file second method is using open method open method can be used to open multiple files with the same file stream object format of file stream classes open method void open it takes two parameters the first one is the name of the file and second is the file mode file name name and location of the file to be opened second parameter mode defines the mode in which file should be opened it is useful for sequential processing of files that is processing files one by one then a single stream object can be used to open different files each file in turn so this is useful for processing the files one by one so same object can be used the same stream object can be used to open different files each file will be open at one time and perform the processing and then we close the file and next time we open the next file so like that sequentially we can process the file one by one by using open method example to open two files country.txt and capital.txt in sequence for writing the data so in this case we have to open two different files sequentially we have to open so first we will create an of stream object the name of the of stream object is out and by us using that out object we open the first file the first file is country.txt and the mode is output mode and then after that we can perform the writing operations and finally we close the file after closing the file now we can open the next file which is country dot which is capital dot txt so that can be opened by using the same stream object out so we call out dot open the name of the next file is capital dot txt and output mode and we can perform different output operations write operations and finally we can close the file example c++ program to open two files named country.txt and capital.txt in sequence for writing and reading details so in this case we have required two files country.txt and capital.txt so first we open country.txt and write details then capital.txt and write details and after that we open the file and read the details so in order to perform write operations we require of stream object so a of stream object is created the name of the object is out by using out we open the file first file which is country.txt and then we can perform by using insertion operator we can write the details into the file so out insertion india so it will write india into the file and we close the file now the next file can be opened similarly by using open method same object out is used to open the file next out dot open next file is capital dot txt with output mode now similarly by using insertion operator we can write the details into the file so we write the capital new delhi into the file and we close the file next we create an if stream object the name of the if stream object is in for reading purpose two variables are declared st1 and st2 
first we open the fi first file which is country.txt by using the in object we open the file and we read it the details and we read the details from the country.txt by using extraction operator we read the detail and store the detail in st1 and close the file the next file need to be open which is capital.txt by using the same object in we open the file in.open capital.txt with input mode for reading purpose next we read the details and store the detail in another variable st2 capital detail and close the file now both the detail country and capital are there in st1 and st2 that can be displayed by using cout statement Closing a file, when a C++ program go out of scope for file stream objects or when the program terminates, it automatically flushes all streams, releases all allocated memory and close all open files. As a good programming practice, all the open files should be closed before the program termination. Close method can be used to close an open file associated with a file stream object explicitly. Closing such a connection does not eliminate the stream, but it disconnects from the file. Format of file stream classes close method, void close. It does not take any parameter, so we can use a close method in order to close the file. So it will remove the file associated with the stream object, it will disconnect the file from the stream object.